Okay, Alan Hardwick, independent candidate for Police and Crime Commissioner in Lincolnshire. What do you make of the low turnout today? I anticipated a low turnout. I think that's because the government have done all they can to ensure a low turnout for their own reasons. I suspect because that is the best way of um, making sure or trying to make sure that their own candidates who have the huge party machine behind them um, stand a better chance of winning. I mean, it's a blatant attempt to, politi to politicise the police forces. So do you think it was um, unfair f uh, for the independents who didn't have as many funds to promote themselves? Oh yes, oh, it, was, it, was, it was so weighted against independent candidates as to be unbelievable and laughable, quite frankly. Um, for a start, £5,000 to find before you can stand, as opposed to £500 if you were going to stand in a general election. A hundred signatures to collect rather than ten if you were going to stand in a general election. So that obviously that mitigates against an independent who is going to have to, whatever their job, is going to have to give that job up uh, for at least a short period of time. Um, and then, you know, be faced with a £5,000 bill. In my case, I had to give my, my job up completely because I have to work for the police authority. It was against the law for me to keep a job uh, with the police authority and stand as an independent. So, yeah, this is not sour grapes. You know, independents went into it with their eyes open. It doesn't mean to say, though, uh, that the system was fair. And if you were to be elected today, the, the new PCC, what would be the first thing you would do? I would start to carry out the priorities that I have um, mentioned in my manifesto um, and they're all dedicated towards being the representative of the people of Lincolnshire, talking to the people of Lincolnshire, listening to their views and making sure that um, the, t the resources um, that we have are targeted to where they can do most good. That's great, thank you very much.